swing the club back and forth continuously like uh, you're holding a, a rope. Then remember again this one here, all the way up, a little bit of uh, circulation here. Yep. Yeah. And all the way down, throw. Give me a little motion in the back swing and throw. So it's like um, arrow, arrow shooting. Mm, build it up, tension, mm, and then let it go. Build it up, tension, and then let it go. So back swing, active back swing, is to uh, build tension in the back swing. My back swing is better than before? Yeah. Okay. And make the back swing a bit faster. So make the back swing a bit more reverse by using the right leg. Kick the, kick the ground with the right leg. Yes. As if you are standing on the right side, yes. Mm -hmm. And throw. Throw. Kick and throw. I feel the power to escape my hands. That means it's a fast enough. And also, your head is a bit too heavy. No. Head is a bit too heavy. That's not even D3. Let me measure that. Yeah. So, your swing weight is actually the high end. Um, or the flex of the shaft. Probably the fourth, no? It's pretty uh, stiff and then you have a fairly heavy head. Yeah, about 450 of swing weight. That's uh, the high, probably the, the highest I can see is about 4, 450. We are close to that. Okay, so uh, then what, that have, what means is that what that means is that if the head is too heavy, oftentimes you lose control. Okay. Then one of the reasons why you don't want to use wrist that much is because it's, it's heavy, so you try to, to dominate it with your muscles instead of uh, letting it go. Throw. So one thing you want to try is uh, remove, um, uh, this one doesn't have any weight. I have other ones. The weight is me. Yeah. Try something like um, a bit uh, lighter head. Yeah. So uh, bring down the swing weight a little bit, and then swing. So that to what? What's what the swing weight here according to you? Well, we are using the actual value. So uh, it's equal to uh, about 450 gram pound. So uh, the the gravity is equivalent to uh, 450 grams. 450 grams, but we don't know what it is on. on it should be, uh, in the rhythmic scale, it should be D2, D3? That's what D3, closer. Yeah, so it's a bit uh, too heavy, but it just uh, try something lighter. And then always, uh, when the head is too heavy, that you cannot use your wrist that way. Well, I you cannot have change, to, yes, I can have to use the whole arm. But, but anyways, let's swing back and forth again. If you have uh, good supination here, it's easier. Right. If, if you it's not working, let it go all the way, and then swing this way, and then try to uh, throw it this way. It's a bit easier uh, on your body. So uh, this arm has to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There, right? Yeah. That's better, no? Yeah. And then let it go, you know. So your goal in the back swing, your goal in the back swing is to see the clip head about yeah. here. You should be able to see the clip head on this side. Yeah. And also, instead of holding it at the end here, try to hold it a bit, uh, so give a little bit of slag here. Okay. Okay. Put your hands in the middle of the grip. So there's no reason to for, hold it. For the exercise or for playing? For the, for the, for the swing. Yeah, for the, for the game. Yeah. Because this is already heavy, and then you're holding at the end of the grip. That means it's a long, it's an even harder to swing. So instead of... Um, you are already in your 60s. So you have to uh, use the device which puts less burden on your body. But at the same time, you use the whole body more efficiently. Yeah. And then swing back and forth, and keep enough back swing. Don't fight at the leg go all the way. Make the back swing a bit faster. Make, make the back swing. In the back swing, yes, yes. Your goal is to throw the club. Yes, yes. Very good. Now, this is really good. So as you increase the vaccine speed, 
So uh, you have a bigger vacuum. So what happens if your hill is uh, leaving the ground? This is good. That means you are putting more weight on the right side. Okay. Again, okay. bigger motion here, and then back go bigger motion. Okay. So that was better. Mm. So increase the vacuum speed. I, I like that. And again, enough a large enough vacuum. Now, all the way down. So once we have enough time here, all the way down, then try to bring the hands in front of your body and try to throw it. So that's the way you have it. You can get the body at hand. Because you have, no, here, no need to worry, no need to worry about this motion here because you have a large enough back swing here at the beginning you're already using the body. All you do is synchronizing the leg action then up by the turn. So, mm, why you got the joke? Uh, keep, keep more back swing and then throw. Oh, this thing. When you intentionally try to use the arms, then always the back swing gets shorter. So, keep enough back swing here, wait here, and then throw. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, the sound, if you hear the sound, the looping sound, it's, it's, uh, the speed is getting higher. So, what you need is you have enough flexion here, larger flexion from here. Try to increase the looping sound by using large motion to wind up here. I have a uh, arthritis in my hands. On your, on your hands are hard to swing. So winter is really bad, huh? Oh. So have the image of have the image of building tension and go. Yeah. Now, as you swing back and forth, your motion is a lot simpler. Yes, I don't have to work with positions. It just, the club goes into the right position. Because you're do, doing uh, this continuous motion. This is, this is dramatic for me. Yeah. This allows my hand, you're right, to get here. And you go this way instead of yeah. kicking you. I go this way. So now I will record this. So give you nerve, back swing. And using the body wind up and then try to throw the glove. Swing, 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 don't fight, and then let it go. Swing, swing, swing. Give more effort in the back swing. Keep the ground with the right leg. Throw, key, and let it go. Key, and let it go. <laughs> it's because of the head is heavy, so uh, the, you need a, a larger centripetal force to bring the control the Swing, don't fight, and let it go. Swing, swing, swing. Give uh, more effort in the back swing. Kick the ground with the right leg. Throw. Kick and let it go. Kick and let it go. You see my hands up? No. <laughs> you couldn't before, right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to say anything. You just uh, <laughs> look at your initial swing and uh, swing now. Yeah. So this is the idea. Um, by using the momentum, and then let it go all the way. Don't fight there. You're just, you're just wasting a uh, lot of necessary. So let go all the way, but sure the back swing. And then with that time, longer transition time, you will have slight recentering. And also your body is uh, now uh, ready for the downswing. Then we can have a, a better uh, initial condition for the downswing. So uh, there's a, you know, nothing good when you rush down. But that doesn't mean you completely stop. 
If you stop, then you lose this the effect of X wing. You have to stop all over again. So you have the continuous X wing to downswing transition, but no rush, no rush in the arms. Now let's go to the step turns. Um, so we'll do uh, the stage three of the step turns, so which uses uh, this trigger motion. Here. So with your regular stance from there, throw the club this way, about this high, about this high, and then because your body already turned this way, so it's easy to uh, generate the active back swing. And in the back swing, make sure you use the right leg. Check the right leg and the active back swing. Yes. And then go to down swing. Swing. Yes. So stage three starts from here. Yeah, and then throw <coughs> the swing. Yes, that uh, action, action was good. But also make this rhythm here. The trigger motion is part of the whole rhythm. So instead of just going here and then try to do this. <coughs> rhythm, 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 rhythm. Yes. And in doing that, in doing that, so let's let's uh, say this. Ooh, BJ sing. Later you can replace this with a better phrase. Or a oh, no, but let's call it the BJ dance. Okay. So, <coughs> BJ sing. <coughs> BJ sing. The D started a bit too early. BJ then accent is when you have a language. J, so here. Ooh. BJ. BJ sing. Yes. BJ sing. Yeah. BJ. Exaggerate the J. BJ sing. Again. BJ. BJ sing. BJ should be higher. BJ sing. BJ. Exaggerate. BJ sing. BJ sing. BJ, Ooh. BJ, sing. Like that. So that uh, exaggerate BJ, that gives you more time up here and then continuous transition. BJ, sing. Yes. BJ, sing. BJ should have a more accent. BJ, BJ, sing. BJ sing. And the that BJ in the accent comes from the right leg push. BJ sing. Can they give a more back swing? BJ sing. Yes. BJ sing. So from now on, what you can do is uh, when you warm up or uh, before the shot, I will let Hold it this way, because it's easier. <laughs> so, BJ sing. BJ sing. Oh my gosh. BJ sing. Yes, continuously. Yes. Then, naturally, you will be able to practice the rhythm. The rhythm. No rush. BJ sing. And then you keep continuous. BJ sing. Sing back. BJ sing. Okay. Ooh. BJ sing, Ooh. BJ sing, come back and then Ooh. BJ sing. Ooh. No, no, no. So Ooh. BJ sing, come back. Ooh. BJ. No, no, no. Yes, yes. BJ. Wait, wait, wait. So start here. Put up this here. Ooh. BJ sing, come back. Ooh. BJ sing, come back. Ooh, BJ sing. Okay. Ooh, BJ sing. Ooh, BJ sing. Ooh, BJ. So B starts too early, huh? BJ B starts too early. Ooh, BJ. Okay, from here to here is BJ. Yeah. From instead here of, to here, instead, instead of right here, here. you start too early. So. BJ because BJ BJ sing yes. Ooh. 
Vijay Singh. Yes. Who? Vijay Singh. Oh, this is where Vijay started earlier. Here. Sorry, there. Who? Vijay Singh. Who? Vijay Singh. Who? Vijay Singh. Who? Vijay Singh. That's good. Vijay Singh. Vijay Singh. Vijay Singh. Now. Just hold it uh, normally here. And now this is heavier, so uh, the tempo may be a bit, uh, should be a bit slower, but. Ooh, BJ Singh. 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 In a dark At the end of the trigger motion, even before time, yeah. this is also tradition. From trigger to backswing transition, backswing to downswing transition, we have the transitions here. Always in the transition, we have the more time. So, ooh, BJ, ooh, and the weight here, instead of ooh, try to pull. Ooh, BJ, sing. Yes, exactly. Ooh, BJ, sing. Now you have the right time. BJ, sing. Yes. Ooh. BJ Singh. Yeah. So what happens is when you rush it here, then you also tend to rush it. Okay. Because okay. you're trying to dive. I can feel me getting long. Mm -hmm. So you have a larger arc here. So uh, now here you are letting the clavet go around your body. BJ Singh. BJ Singh. Always uh, the same rhythm. Now you will probably have this in your dream. Vijay Singh. Vijay Singh. Oh, rest, rest, rest. Vijay Singh. So, in order to make this swing easier, you have to let it go all the way here. Don't, don't slide here. You know, part of the reason you get a little tired is because you try to hold it. You tend to stop. Vijay Singh. Vijay Singh. DJ Sing. Okay, I got you. Instead of trying to dominate with uh, your wrist. Ooh. DJ Sing. DJ Sing. It's uh, trick motion too big. Trick motion too big. You're going all the way here. But yeah. On the. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Yeah. Trick about. Ooh. Yeah. DJ Sing. Ooh. DJ Sing. In the back swing, let go more. DJ Singh. Mm -hmm. It's this arm that doesn't want to turn, you know? That's better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when you keep this motion, it's easier to uh, bring the curve uh, more. Yeah. yeah, that's better. Yeah, that's better. That makes uh, the back swing motion completely yeah. different when you let the, the forearm swing here. Yeah. Now, both hands. Okay. It's called the BJ dance. And you can change the name later. BJ. BJ Sing. BJ Sing. BJ Sing. BJ Sing. Give more accent to BJ. Instead of Ooh, BJ, is that, is that this? Ooh, BJ! Totally extend the, at the end of BJ. Ooh, BJ Sing! Yes, when you do that. Ooh, BJ Sing! Yes, when you do that, you're connecting the back swing to the ground swing. BJ Sing! So back swing to ground swing is a continuous motion. BJ Sing! Yes. BJ Singh. BJ Singh. So the whole purpose of the trigger motion is to promote active backswing. With active backswing, you'll have larger backswing, more time here, and your body will be better prepared. And on the way down, you can just the neck go. Okay. So now, so this is a continuous swing, but let's now do a cycle by cycle. So, BJ Singh. Finish.
This is stage three of the two steps. It has a stage one and two. Yeah. Stage one, you actually take the steps here in the swing. And then in stage two, only one step toward the target. And then in stage three, no step. Mm. <clears throat> but as you do this, more than that, you have to feel the body. Yes. The, the, the the back back on, on. We've got more work about leg actions. Leg action. So stage three. Now, stage, uh, second leg. Follow through, yeah. oh. cycle, cycle by cycle. So stay three. Boom. BJ swing. And then wind up more in the back swing. The downstream speed is coming from good wind up. Boom. Yeah. BJ swing. Yes. That's good. Boom. Yeah. BJ swing. That was good. I feel my arm is totally different. Yeah. I feel I don't feel restricted. My shoulders in the right place. What I commonly see in the gopers uh, in their 60s, 70s, they always go to this way. They try to hold it this way, and then try to hit the ball with the arms here. They are very really strong still. They do a lot of uh, you know, workouts, but they want to stop by the end and try to use the arms only. But in order to let it go, then you have to hit the arms. But as long as you go this way, it's hard to hit. But when you Cut the forearm this way, then uh, the arm goes to the right side. And this is the natural way, right? This is what it should happen. Yeah. Now let's recall the stage three here. So when I say go, yeah, is my posture okay or am I a little crouched? Yeah. Don't, don't worry about the posture. As you repeat this motion back and forth with the rhythm, your body naturally adjusts it. Okay, so don't try to intentionally go to a certain body positions. Just let it flow, let it flow. Just ride the rhythm as if, as if you ride the tide, okay? Boom, BJ sing. And give a, give a bigger action, give a bigger action. BJ sing. So that means, BJ sing. So give a faster back swing. Throw the, throw the club in the back swing, yes. BJ sing. So when you have good throw. Oh, yes. The club goes like when you put the row this way, then you'll go enough and then wait there and then in one action let go of the bounce. Okay? So always uh, when you reduce the size of X wing, then you are using your arms more and more. DJ mm -hmm. Yeah. DJ Okay, let me record this. So when I say go in the uh, swing, okay, ready, ready, stage three, go. The stage three, go. Uh, uh, a bit bigger. So faster back swing and the bigger back swing motion. So again, ready. Just say, stop, 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 stop. So when I say go and then swing. But in order to have a really active back swing and then large enough back swing, you have from the trigger, from here, by using body turn, you have to throw the club instead of yeah. try to use your arms. Okay. Right. Uh, so, just a second. Ready, stay three, go. Ready, stay three, go. Ready, stay three, go. Stay three, go. Instead of, or 
Mm -hmm. So let's go again to the pull this way. Okay. Or this way. Okay. So imagine your your sword is slightly uh, um, bent. Now, then you can easily slide so with easily throw the sword from the ship. Right? You know what I used to do a lot is put a bucket right here. When I was swinging, I would swing outside of the bucket. Hmm. And hit the ball back. Yeah. So but still, it shouldn't be an arm driven earlier on. So go up here, good, right up here, and then try to have the feel of uh, drawing the sword. So pulling the club along the shaft instead of okay, the pull this out. Okay. okay. So instead of doing this, I want to be doing this. Mm -hmm. So then run right? Like this run. Again. This is the battery should be bigger. Battery should be faster and bigger. Again. Uh, so let's do cycle by cycle, cycle by cycle. Uh, wait, wait. Instead of going that way first, that means that you are introducing another trigger. Okay, let's go over this way. So from here, just go this way and then. Because in the end, we have to eliminate the triggers. Right? So just go this way. And then, oh, it has to be using the bite turn. Throw. Even in the back swing, throw the club around. Yes. Throw, throw the club, but you have to have it slow down nicely. Yeah. Other time. Yeah. Instead of uh, letting it go all the way. Again. Yeah, so usually what happens is that when you have a faster reaction, that you feel unstable again. Yeah. It's because it's a world stop. When you just let it go too fast here and then start, try to stop it abruptly, then you feel this, uh, instability. But your goal is to move the cravat around nicely and then slow down here and then reach this place here. So slow down and then let it go. Slow down and then let it go. Test the motion, but slow down here. You have stable in the motion here. Mm -hmm. Yes, your goal is to control the cravat motion. I'm guiding it instead of using the button. Okay. Yes. So that overall shape is now good. So then increase the speed in the back swing. Yes. yes. So using this momentum here, using the back swing momentum, you are creating good control of that. Let it go. Now, so let's practice this. So you need to emphasize the back swing more than using the right leg. So we'll do a uh, VJ uh, dance, but this time, intentionally slow down this motion, get active motion here. So, so small trigger motion here. DJ sing. DJ sing. So, smaller trigger motion, but really active action by using the right leg. Mm -mm. It's just a stop. Pretty much you stop. Ooh, all the way. So, yeah. Intentionally, we will slow down this motion here. So, so then, don't let this club go uh, past this point. So on this side, make it smaller, and then only emphasize the back swing by using the right hand. Oh, no, no, not all the way. Come down, come down here, you just mm, mm, come down here. No, no, no swing. Just come down to this point. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Ooh. Mm, mm. Oh, ooh. 
you just did enough clean that you don't have to in the bed. Where? Here. In the, in the bed, you're using this record. <coughs> Yes. Not there? <coughs> and then with that, with that action, you, you try to turn the shoulder as much as possible. You have to wind up and start the downstream with the body turn instead of arms. You still have a tendency of using the arms. Yes. Turn the, turn the shoulders. Yes. So not bad. Yeah. You have the excess here, the spine excess. You need the shoulder here, and then throw, and throw. I felt it, I felt it up here. Yes, yes, yes. Right. So using the wind, uh, throw. Yes. Okay. Much better. That way you can use the back swing to promote the active downswing. So it's always hard to uh, reprogram someone with a lot of golfing uh, experience and uh, who are really an uh, arm doctor. If you do turn that way for so long uh, in your 60s and 70s, it's hard to reprogram. But you are doing quite well. So just uh, all you need to do is uh, give enough, just enough motion of the club head and uh, don't restrict it, but go along with the club motion. That's my trick. My trick is to turn correctly and let the turn of the body bring the yeah, yeah. And then throw this instead of using the arms, right? Yes. The sound is very different. Much better, right? Again. Good wind up. Good wind up. Yes. All you, all you need to worry about is have good body wind up. And then. So I have the image of uh, using these muscles here and turn the whole upper body. Using these muscles, turn the whole upper body. Then there you go. Again. So I bet you can be faster. I bet you can be faster. Yes. Yes. So when the back swing is fast, when the back swing is fast, then you are make the head bigger motion. Then curl it travels more. So you don't have to intentionally control this. Just uh, let I'm not trying to control it. I'm okay. trying to do what you told me. Yeah. Then go all the way and, and then the hands are going by themselves. Yeah. So uh, let's uh, record this and then uh, finish. You've been uh, swinging too much today. Okay, so when I say go and then do the state three, Ready, state three, go. And as you repeat this state three again and again, or do the VJ dance again and again, try to find a really comfortable flow in the lower body driven motion. So, ready, state three, go.
And then in doing that, no rush, so uh, push, wait, and then push, and wait, push, and wait. So uh, the accent is always a push again. Push, 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 push. Mm, is there just, is there turning the body? Push, and then wait, and wait, and then it, it, push. Wait until it finishes here. Oh. And then push, and wait, oh. push, and then wait. This side is also the hip has to go up here. So push. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Push and then push and then wait. Push. So from here, then you start the basic also keep you know, Push and wait and then push and wait. And then push and wait. Push and push and wait. Push. 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 So what happens, what happens is when you put push, when you put push, this happens. Push and slide the right thing. Push and the right thing. And then so it's recentering. Push, slide, recentering. Push, slide, recentering. Push, slide, recentering. Push. Push. Wait. Wait here until this is completed. And then slide, recentering. Then push here, okay. and then wait, slide, present here, wait, and then push here, wait, push here, push here, push here, push here, push here, push here. So the exit is a push. Man, you, you must dance salsa very well. <laughs> <laughs> I am supposed to be a good salsa dancer. I'm supposed to, you know, I'm always because it was a bad dancer. I'm afraid of some swimming by this movement. People. That's why. But you do. That's why. But, 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 but uh, I'm always uh, aware of the rhythm. So we can have a good rhythm in action here. Push, 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 and push, and push, and push, 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 push. push. Mm. And then, so when you always push and then turn, so instead of uh, introducing short of the early, yeah, push and it, 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 but instead of uh, introducing the short of the early, push and wait until you start this push. Push and turn, and then push and turn. Okay. And so I, I gotta get here. And push and turn. Push and turn. Push. Yes. Push. Yes. Push. Push. So then at the top of the dexing here, at the top of the dexing here, you push and then wait, slide to recenter here, and then this pushing will give you this turn here. Instead of turning the short turning. Okay. And then wait here and then push the turn. Yes. That way you can promote the rotation with the leg action. Yeah, I always want to do this. But you always have this what you have tendency of go up here and you quickly try to return. Yes. We have to hold this, and then, yeah, and then bring the, then tie it. Yeah, that, that way, by kicking the ground, you will get to throw the arms. Yeah. So in the end, what should happen is the leg action should promote the turn, turn, and instead of shoot and then try to pull, pull, Put it then it's a more arm motion. Use right. the leg action and turn. There. Uh, board shift and then standing on the right side. And then. So here, yeah, stand tall on this side, stand tall on this side, stand tall on this side. Yes, stand tall. Tall on this side. Right? And then. And then. Stand tall from here goes. Stand tall on this side. Okay. There. There. Ah, uh, then as soon as you connect, then your back swing <laughs> was discouraged. So, yeah. push, push, instead of push, push, push here, and then push. A good push with the push. right leg. Mm. Push, again, yeah, still you. Push, so in order to have good push, you slide, you shift, and then push. That push it has to uh, make, be a main thing. Push. To this position. Okay. Instead of initial push and then start. Okay. Push. 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 Push.
Push all the way here. Push all yeah, yeah. right. So that push gives you good wind up. Yeah. Using the leg push and here yeah. to create this wind up and the recentering. And then from there, push. So by, by now the left leg is uh, flexed here. Mm -hmm. So you can easily push the ground. By pushing the ground with the left leg and then it, it turns by itself. So this section here. So now let's do this. Keep your hand, right hand on the belly. And then throw this left arm as deep as possible. But from there, throw the arm this way. Throw the hand. Now it's not throwing, it's just a swing. It's not throwing. Okay. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> Using the leg again. Okay. <coughs> ah, you're putting too much effort. Oh, this side, you're not using the wide leg. Wide up and then throw. Wide up and throw. Yes. That's fair. Wide up and then throw the arms. Wide up, throw. So still, your arm stops here, that means you are intentionally doing this. But if the arm is thrown, throw with the flex, I guess. I don't do it intentionally in flex this. So, throw in the community. Yeah. Put wind up in the back and throw. Yeah, still I can see that you're using this arm here. But it's hard to get away from this method because you, you've done this for uh, that's what, uh, for a long time. Yeah, yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Overall, your motion pattern is a lot better. You have a larger range of motion now. Okay. So keep working on the continuous motion. <coughs> BJ sing. And then that BJ is not just the exaggerating with your that's sound, that, but you have to This is a throwing motion right there? Yeah, here. So here. BJ sing. So as you BJ, the motion should be BJ and then sing. Yeah, I'm here and I'm supposed to be here. Yeah. That's better, huh? Mm. DJ Sing. Yes. Then you can use the DJ Sing. You can use the body. Because the body is uh, one one of here with this throw. DJ Sing. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. So always you have to use the wind up in the back swing. DJ Sing. Particularly at your age. Okay. You have to use the body instead of just relying on the arms. Okay. Yeah, so uh, that's, that's the idea. So practice on the rhythm. Okay, okay.